Rebirth Island is finally back and the sweat levels are off the charts. So if you want to survive, you are going to need the meta loadout for this season. And a massive shout out to every single one of you guys because we just managed to hit 5k subs on the channel. We got partnered on YouTube and the last movement guide had insane, insane amounts of love coming at it from you guys. So thank you for every like, every share and every kind word you said in the comments. And if you haven't seen that video yet, I promise you, you're missing out because without any jokes, without over exaggerating, this is the best movement guide in Warzone history. And with the sweat levels on Rebirth, you are going to need it, not just the meta. For the mid and long range meta, we got three weapons. Starting off with the Lachman 556 from Modern Warfare 2. It already had a great rate of fire and now its damage got buffed. And by adding Modern Warfare 3 attachments, this weapon becomes a laser beam at mid range, making it one of the perfect options for Rebirth Island. In second place, we got the SPA 545. And the only reason I'm including this weapon is because if you burst it while it's still on full auto, no sniper will stand a chance and you will kill them every single time. Is he still above me? Yep, he's just camping. Oh my, th this is where this weapon is good. He will flinch hard. And in first place, we got the battle rifle, the SOA. It's been the meta since last season, and now it's here to stay. I like to use it with a Jack Glasses optic, but sometimes I switch it up and remove the optic and put a stock instead. Both are great loadouts, but personally, I use it with an optic because at long ranges, I want to be able to see if the target is moving a lot. And now for the close range meta. Starting off with the buff Blackman sub or the MP5 from Warzone 2. Yes, it got buffed, but it's not enough. The weapon is still trash and nothing compared to what the meta is. And the new SMG, the FGX Horus, is nice, but it's almost the same as the Lachman sub. It's nowhere near being the meta. I'm saying this just in case you guys see some VPN buff lobby guys that are saying it's the meta while they're killing people that don't shoot back. Because this happens every single season. Every weapon that's buffed is the meta for some reason. Now for what the meta is, it's the Renetti pistol with a conversion kit. The time to kill is not only better than all the SMGs, but it's also better than some ARs at 20 meters. But I think that it will be nerfed really soon. And when that happens, there's gonna be other SMGs taking its spot. So in second place for the close range meta, we got the HRM9 followed by the Striker 9 and then the WSP 9. To become one of the best players in the world, you're going to need four things. Number one is to have a great loadout, which we just covered for this season. Number two and three is to have great aim and movement. And for that, I have the perfect guide for you on this channel. And the last one is probably the hardest one, which is to be self-conscious and self-aware of what your current skill level is and what you should work on and what you shouldn't, all while trying to apply most, if not all of the movement and aim tips at the same time while you're playing and for that i have two solutions the first solution is going to be in my next youtube video that is going to be targeted towards all the players that want to improve in warzone and regardless of their skill level whether it's low medium or high there is something that will help them in that video the second solution is a personalized one just for you sometimes it's going to be hard for you to see your own mistakes and if you do it's even harder to know where to start or how to start improving in this game and this is where i can help you with my personalized one-on-one -on -one coaching that will give you your own personalized and tailored coaching program that works with where you currently are and works towards where you want to be. And I can guarantee you that it will blow your mind. So if you want to have a quick chat and learn more about the personalized coaching that I offer, click on the link in the description below and book your consultation call for free.